This is TCAP practice test for grade 8, question number 41. What is the slope of the line represented by this equation? The nice thing for me to do would be to put it in slope-intercept form. It would be nice because then I would have a slope given to me. Slope-intercept form is that y equals form. So I'm trying to get y by itself. So I'll rewrite the equation. And then I can find the slope. Um, I'm going to get rid of everything that's not y. So I'm going to use a little highlighter here and find y. Anything that's not this, I need to move over to the other side of the equation. So the first thing I'm going to do is move the thing furthest away from that y, which is the 4x. So in order to get rid of plus 4x, I need to subtract 4x. By the way, this is plus 4x, not because of this. The 4x cannot see that. If you do not see something in front of that 4x term, it is plus. If it had been 4x minus 2y, I would still do minus 4x because the 4x is plus. Whatever I do to one side, I need to do to the other. These cancel out. So I'm going to bring down 2y is equal to negative 4x plus 6. I'm almost done. Now I need to get rid of times 2, so I'm going to divide by 2. I need to divide everything by 2. Well, not really for this question, but in general I do, so I'm going to continue forward with it. Negative 4 divided by 2 is negative 2x, and 6 divided by 2 is 3, plus 3. Now, the only thing I need is the slope, which would be whatever is in front of the x, because I have y equals mx plus b. That's the slope. So this thing. So my final answer is b. Also, uh, I should mention that if x and y are on the same side, if you're going to find the slope of it, uh, in this case, uh, as long as there's an equal sign there and that whole thing, if x and y are on the same side, it's going to be the opposite sign of whatever x happens to be at the beginning of the problem. So you have that plus 4 right there. Well, you know you're going to have to move it, so it's got to be a negative. And it could be negative 4 or negative 2. You'll have to work that out once you get there. But at least you could eliminate c and d, which gets you somewhere. So good luck.